and welcome back to the Lewis Twin channel. I'm so excited that you are here for today's video and I'm also so excited to be filming today's video. In today's video, we are going to be getting ready for fall, doing our fall decor, shopping for our fall decor, putting it up, and also like baking some fall recipes and watching like some fall movies, just like a whole fall themed vlog. And I'm so excited because I love summer. Summer is so fun, my favorite season, but I've been seeing like on Instagram, people are like doing like fall stuff and it makes me want to also do fall stuff. And it's like the end of August, so I think we've waited long enough to start the fall stuff. So me and Brittany are definitely excited to jump into the fall season. Before I started talking to you guys, we went to our storage unit. If you didn't know, we have a storage unit where we store all of our decor in and just stuff that we don't want in our apartment. And this year, I know last year we did fall and Halloween decorations combined, but this year we want to do fall and Halloween separate. And I think it's gonna be so cute because we got tired of in October having the Halloween decorations up because we put them up entirely too early. So we want to give each decoration their time to shine so we don't get tired of them. So we're going to do fall first and then in October or September we're going to do the Halloween decorations. But anyway, we went to our storage unit and we got all the fall stuff that we had, the fall themed stuff. We didn't know we had as much fall stuff as we have. So we were super excited about that because we want to do a pink, white, and orange theme. That's what our fall decorations are going to be giving. We have a few things we still want to get from the store. I'm going to just read them off on my phone and we're going to see if we can find them in the stores that we're going to be going to today. We did this like last night because we want to have more orange in our decorations because we definitely have a lot of pink and white but we don't have as much orange as we want for the season. We want to find some orange lights and some fairy lights to go. The fairy lights will probably go around our bed and lights we're gonna go like in various places around the apartment and then we want to get some cups for ice drinks we have some mugs but we want to get cups for ice drinks sheets for our beds pumpkins for our bed and nightstand something orange lighting wise for our bathroom pillows for our couch but i think that we solved that problem when we went to the storage unit we have pillows so i think we're good on that apple and pumpkin spice syrup really wants a pumpkin jelly cat for our beds so we're gonna be on the lookout for that and then decor for our coffee cart because i just like to do the coffee cart seasonally so definitely some decor to make it scream fall a blanket for the beds i'm specifically looking for a knit blanket because i don't know knit just screams fall to me but if they don't have it then we're gonna have to get another type of blanket orange ribbon i know we have an orange ribbon but maybe we have more orange ribbon because we literally just have like a piece of orange ribbon about this long we want more to decorate stuff with and then also do candles but i think we're also good on this i'm saying that now but let's see when we get in tj maxx because we have like at least five candles that were in our storage unit but I don't know. I always feel like I need more candles. And then I saw this idea on Instagram where someone decorated their coffee cart with leaves. Maybe I'll do that. Maybe I won't. We'll see. But we are about to head out. The stores that we have in mind we want to go to are Target, TJ Maxx, Marshalls, Bath and Body Works. We are heading on out and I'm so excited to get this fall season started. Okay, so before we go, we wanted to show our outfit. So I'm just wearing this brown dress that we got from Target last year and I I've been waiting for the perfect time to break it out and today is that day. I'm just wearing my white pumas with these. I don't really have any fall shoes yet. We're going to be getting those later in the season. And then I don't know if you can see this, but I just have this white lacy bow that I tied in my hair. This is my outfit. I actually had a long sleeve shirt on, but when we went to go do our storage unit, it is literally entirely too hot. I don't know why fall for some people starts on August 1st. It's literally 80 degrees out, but I still have put this plaid brown skirt on. I thought that this was like giving a very much fall. I just have like these two French braids that Brianna did for me and I have these white bows in my hair. And then I'm going to be wearing these like Mary Jane shoes. I just don't have them on right now because honestly they were hurting my feet when I went to the storage unit. <laughs> but yeah, we are super excited to start this fall shopping. to TJ Maxx. We just left Starbucks. It was an apple crisp shaken oat milk espresso and I don't like espresso. I don't really like coffee and I really shouldn't drink me espresso because it makes me act crazy. But I'm excited to get into our shopping and normally I'm a person when I start shopping I like to get the heck out of there. I like to go in, get what I want and leave. So I think me having this espresso is going to be good. It's going to give me some energy and I'm going to want to look around. We also have non-dairy apple cold foam. 
well, so I got that on top too. I'm super excited to see what we can find. I know some girls have literally been shopping for fall since June, which is like kind of crazy to me. I didn't even know they would have stuff out there. store a little bit disappointed disappointed because they have a lot of halloween stuff but they don't have a lot of just fall stuff and i don't know why that is i don't know if it's because they, a lot of people don't buy as much fall i don't really know we're gonna do a little haul in a little bit but since these are sitting right here i want to talk about this really quick they had these little anthropology do cups there and the anthropology ones are literally like 16 dollars for a cup this was 13 for two and you guys saw the footage of we found a pumpkin one but it was missing one of them i found a worker and i was trying to talk to her about it because i was saying that there's supposed to be two cups in there and there's only one and i think somebody took it and she was like no like I'm sure it's somewhere around the store. Like, I didn't think to look around the store. And she looked around the store and she was like, yeah, there's only one. Like, maybe somebody took it or it broke. And I'm like, yeah, I said that already. That was the only one that they had left. So we're trying to figure out a way to get a pumpkin one. But for now, we just have the ghost one. But the ghost is getting very much October. Like, we wanted a pumpkin one for fall. We want to order some... <laughs> I'm laughing because we literally just did all that shopping, but we want to order some stuff because like we said, they didn't have the Snoopy fall bed sheets we wanted. They didn't have pillows for the bed. They didn't really have anything fall unless it was Halloween related. So we wanted to go on TJ Maxx website, which they have a little bit more than what they had in the store or Amazon or something and get the stuff that we did not get, which some orange lights, some fall bed sheets. We also went to Target to try to get some of the food shopping and they don't have anything. I'm like, the people on the YouTube are lying to me, like, saying that all their Target has all this stuff, their TJ Maxx has all this stuff. Like, I'm like, not to be like, we live in New York, but like, if some place is going to have the stuff, wouldn't it be New York City? And they don't. Maybe we'll go back sometime in September. And we know we literally listed all these stores we were going to. It's giving money. My knuckles were bruised like violet. I really feel like I survived the Great War going to Union Square. So we won't be doing that stuff. We're going to be doing it a different day later in this vlog. So you guys won't really be missing anything. We're going to go to Bath and Body Works and maybe some of those other stores that we mentioned on Wednesday. But I physically cannot do it today. We left around 12 o'clock. It is now 4.30. We're not going to decorate today because like I said, I'm super, super tired and we have some packages coming in that haven't arrived yet and they'll be here on Wednesday. And we're going to do a quick little haul and then we will see you on a Wednesday. So it is finally Wednesday and I'm so excited to finish this fall themed video. We didn't get to do everything we wanted to do on Monday because we were tired as we said and then we also were waiting for some things to come in from Amazon that we ordered. We're going to start today off by finishing the shopping that we didn't do the other day. We're going to start by going to Bath and Body Works to get a few fall scents. I'm not really sure how much fall they have right now because I've been seeing a lot of people posting about Halloween in there so hopefully they have some fall stuff in there for us. Then after that we're going to be going to 
to Wegmans because we want to get a few ingredients for this lasagna soup we want to make. We made this lasagna soup in the winter time and we've been thinking about this since we made it then so we're like this would be the perfect time to make it again. So we're going to go ahead and get some ingredients. I know one of the things we want to get is impossible sauces. They don't sell it anywhere near us besides Wegmans so we're going to go there. Hopefully they have some pumpkin fall themed stuff in there because Target didn't have a lot so I hope that they have some nice yummy fall foods that we can get. Hopefully they're vegan too. We're going to head on out. We just got back from Bath and Body Works and Wegmans and honestly I was expecting a little bit more from Wegmans. Nobody told me when you go into Wegmans you literally need like a full on puffer jacket. It is so cold in there so I feel like I wasn't able to really shop and look around like I wanted to do. We found some little bit of fall finds. They didn't really have a lot of stuff. I don't know what's going on I guess because it's still August. Like I said earlier in the video they don't really have all the stuff out we got these Velveeta pumpkin spice cookies that we have had before these are literally so good so we got these Wegmans also had these vegan cookies I think we got molasses and peanut butter so we're gonna be eating these later as a snack I'm literally so hungry we did not eat breakfast for some reason we're gonna be making lunch here shortly we're not gonna show that because it's just I didn't know impossible made chicken tenders so we got those and some fries for lunch but we're having the soup for dinner because it has to cook in the crock pot that we got that we're gonna show you I want to show you guys what we got from Bath and Body Works we didn't really do a lot of filming in Bath and Body Works because like for some reason the woman who was working there literally was like following us around the store it was kind of like making me a little bit uncomfortable I don't know if we're allowed to record in there but I just had my phone but every time I was like pulled my phone up to record she was there and I was like what is going on we got this big bag of stuff from Bath and Body Works we left with three candles for some reason but we have like eight here already first we got two of these this is just their pumpkin cupcake hand soap we got one for our bathroom and one for our kitchen this smells so good and like Brianna said earlier in the video we are going to be doing a orange and pink and white theme it smells so so we wanted to add a little bit more pink in too. We just got two single wick candles. This one is caramel pumpkin swirl. This one also smells so good. But again, we wanted to add the pink in. And then this next one we got is pumpkin bonfire. We want to do a mix of very sweet and also savory type of candles just so it's not like an overwhelming sweetness in the home. This literally smells so good. And then we got another candle. This one is pumpkin clove. Look how pretty that design is. It has orange in it, but also has like a little pinky orange in it too to like tie in the colors we want to do. Ron and I love the Christmas song that I met a man. And who lives in Tennessee? And I smelled this. And I said, this is giving. I met a man who lives in Tennessee. This is a Thanksgiving candle for some reason to me. It's not really a September one, but we're going to probably light it anyway. Then we got a set of three little body products because they were having a sale on their hair, body, and skin or something. So we got Autumn Drive. This is going to be our body wash until it runs out. Again, this is like not really like an overly sweet one. Autumn Drive, again, this is the lotion. And then we got Autumn Drive as the fragrance. Then we got two little hand sanitizers. Brianna got pumpkin pecan waffles. I got sweet cinnamon pumpkin. The reason I didn't get the same one Brianna got is because that one is really sweet. <laughs> and this is probably what I'm most excited about. I did not know Bath & Body Works sold lip products, but we got two lip products products this is the pumpkin spice lip scrub this is the lip mask and pumpkin spice too next we are going to finally get into the decorating mood we bought all of our scents so we're gonna go ahead and take our showers we're also gonna eat lunch we're not gonna show you guys us eating lunch we did buy some pajamas actually if you guys have been on instagram and you've been seeing the viral american eagle snoopy two-piece set they sold out of that. But we did get the romper, which I'm super excited to show you guys when we put that on and we bought a pair of socks. Perfect for our fall decorating. And then we also have one product that we got from last year, the Trader Joe's Pumpkin Exfoliant. So we're also going to be using that in our shower too. I'm super excited to finally get more into the fall mood. I'm super ready to take a shower. Anytime I go anywhere in New York, when I get home, I'm ready to shower because New York is disgusting.
So we just finished our showers and the autumn drive from Bath and Body Works literally smells so good. We both literally are walking around smelling like apples. <laughs> now we're about to start to prep our lasagna soup I was telling you about earlier, just so while we are doing our decorations, it can be cooking in our crock pot. But we are waiting on one ingredient from Target. I literally forgot when we were in Wegmans to get the tomato sauce for the soup. So I had to order that. We're gonna go ahead and just prep everything else and start it cooking in the crock pot. drinking sipping on this while we decorate but before we decorate last thing before we decorate we want to make a fall playlist that's why i have this computer right here and we're going to be making a playlist on spotify i already have like a list of songs that i want to add to this probably be adding more songs to this playlist throughout the month and we're also going to have the link in our description in case you want some fall inspiration we want to play this while we decorate to really get into the fall mood give all the fall vibes officially time for us to start decorating finally <laughs> i know we've been keep saying we are going to decorate now we are going to start i'm not sure what we're going to start with i think we're going to start with the coffee cart because that's kind of the most thing in our apartment we know what we want to do with it i think we're going to put on the playlist and start with our coffee cart our decorations and we are going to be doing a room tour it is officially dark outside right now it is literally like almost eight o'clock and we want to do a little walk through of our room and all of our stuff it came together so cutely we don't have that much fall stuff nor do stores make that much fall stuff so we have like a subtle hint of fall we do want to add a little 
bit more decorations. Lights, definitely, to make it nice and snug in here at night. Sorry if this is dark. This part of our room does not get a lot of light, and I can't use the light that's on the camera right here because it's going to make this really difficult to see because the mirror. But I think this part turned out so cute. We just have a cute little pumpkin here. And then this says blushing apple cider, but honestly, this is just decoration at this point because we have used this down to the bone. And then we just have our fragrance here that we just bought today and yeah this is cute and super simple on this side and then this is our coffee cart i think it turned out super cute this candle that we have right here smells so good and it looks cute with the little orange ribbon and everything and our syrups right here with the chai and everything we want to put more fall type teas and stuff in here they just don't have that many right now as we were saying like target is still on college move-in day then we have this little setup this is like a pumpkin but we just open the top up to put our little pumpkin spice snacks in here and we have four orange cups we were planning on putting those pumpkin cups we wanted to give from pj maxx up here for our ice drinks but we have to find different cups to put up here and then this fake plant with this pink little bow. Ignore all that stuff back there. We are in the process of making our soup, as we've said, and Brown is back there. This is our couch. We have the orange blanket. I think this part turned out super cute. I do want to find some type of pillow or something to add to our couch because it just looks a little bit plain to me but this is what it is right now this is all the stuff we have to put in our storage unit over here like our halloween stuff i think that this is super cute i don't know why i just got the urge to do this our puzzle i didn't know where to put it so i just put our puzzle here and use it as decoration instead of putting it away and then adding our white pumpkin candle here then we just have taylor here and i wish we had more of like a fall album here but we just have portrait poets for now and then we have our pumpkin candle here we have like two of these and this is our nightstand we just have a pink pumpkin here and then we have this candle that we got today the caramel pumpkin swirl these are both of our beds i'm gonna do a close-up look here we have these cute snoopy with the leaves very on theme for this year's autumn apparently because our rompers are the exact same thing and then we just have our regular pillows but we also added an orange pillow just to have the pink and orange vibe going on the beds i think this area of our apartment looks so cute and just like i want to like get in my bed right this second the bathroom is i don't know what we're doing <laughs> we have our soap here and i don't know if i really care for this we did have an extra kitchen towel so we we're like maybe we should put it in the bathroom with this candle and then we have this from last year's bath and body works trip pumpkin pecan and waffle spray which smells so good but it's just very plain but i'm like it's a bathroom i think it's i think it's okay if it's pretty plain that is our room tour and i think it turned out really cute for this year's fall season i know we were saying we need more stuff but i don't know i don't want to be too much out because we are doing a halloween too this is probably only going to be up for like two or three weeks so i don't know if we should add a bunch of stuff or just like leave what we have we are going to be making our soup next because i'm super 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 hungry so we finish our fall decorations and i really like how they turned out so now we're going to finish the soup the part that we put it in the crock pot is finished but we still have to make the meat that's gonna go in it so we're gonna use this impossible light beef and the reason that we got the light was because at wagons they didn't have the regular kind so we got this and then like i said earlier we wanted to put sausage in it so we got this and then we're also gonna make our garlic bread and i'm super excited for this to come together i've been dreaming about this soup since we made it in january and also we're gonna make a cashew like cheese sauce to go in this soup but i'm not gonna show you that because it gets kind of messy but if you guys are interested in the recipe we can just tell you in the comments if you want to know but yeah it's a dairy-free cashew cheese sauce that we're gonna make to put in here like a ricotta
our soup is all ready. This literally looks so good. I cannot wait to eat this. And then we just have garlic bread with that. And then we put our orange cream skull poppy in this ghost glass. We tried the orange cream skull for the first time a few days ago. It's pretty good. It's like more like a summer flavor. And they don't have any fall poppies out or anything yet. We were like, this one's orange, so we'll just get this. We were going to end our night of decorating and everything by watching the Gilmore Girls while we eat dinner. We are on season two, episode 13. We haven't watched this in a while. I don't know why we stopped watching it. I think it's because we didn't have a Netflix account for a while. We got kicked out of Netflix and everything. Now we are back in full swing and I'm excited to watch this. Mm -hmm. 